Okay, so introduce yourself. My name is Dr. Ashley Curver, and I'm the owner doctor at Cross Point Dillon Orthodontics. And you're located where? We are located off of 287 and Cooper in the same shopping center as the movie theater. Um, I wanted to ask you how technology um, has had an impact on dentistry. So it's had a lo very large impact on dentistry and definitely for the benefit of the patients. Uh, there's three main areas dental radiology or dental x-rays. Mm -hmm. um, we have the ability to make the x-ray size larger, making um, it easier to diagnose and diagnose early on. Um, the second area would be in cone beam or CT imaging, okay. which gives us a 3D image um, of, of two structures and helps us also diagnose things that may not be evident on um, a dental x-ray. Okay. Um, the third one is uh, in computer-aided implant dentistry. Mm -hmm. So it, uh, we can actually plan an implant surgery on the computer and uh, make a surgical guide. So it makes the uh, surgical procedure plug and play pretty much. Hmm, okay. So previously, how were those things done? So previously, uh, it's very possible that treatment may have been delayed because it wasn't evident on an x-ray. Okay. Um, and so the and with the 3D imaging, we may not have been able to have access to that or access to it at a reasonable charge. Okay. So uh, the patient may have had symptoms and uh, treatment wasn't rendered because we weren't quite for sure where the symptoms were coming from. So what do you feel the future trends are when it comes to technology and dentistry? Well, uh, there's actually, um, currently in dental radiology, we're able to, there's a software that helps us diagnose dental decay mm -hmm. so it can read the, the film that was taken mm -hmm. and tell us if there's actually decay there. Um, they're in the process of developing a software that will actually um, tell the dentist if mm -hmm. there is decay. Like it will read the x-ray for us and say wow. there's decay here that we may not be able to see uh, with our eye. Is there really a link? I've, I've always heard there's this link between um, healthy gums and teeth and your body. <clears throat> yeah, there, there definitely is a link and the research is still being done on what what type of link there is. Um, we do know currently that patients that have diabetes are more likely to have gum disease, mm -hmm. which ultimately causes tooth loss if not treated. Um, there's also been research done with heart disease and stroke um, related to um, d gum disease in the mouth also. So there's definitely still more research that's being done and I think that we don't even know what kind of link that there is. The, the, um, but there definitely is a link. With all of that said, what's, what's your best advice to give someone? So I would definitely recommend that patients see their dentist at least twice a year to, to have a preventative cleaning done because prevention is key. Mm -hmm. Once there's um, dental decay, you know, we're gonna have to treat the tooth. The longer the patient waits, the more expensive it is and the treatment is much more extensive also. What happens when it's gone past the point of no return? as far as... You can't prevent it, you can't, so what happens? <clears throat> so if there's d decay yeah. or if there's gum disease, so if there's decay, we remove the, the decay and we treat the tooth either with um, a, a dental filling or a crown depending on how much decay there is, uh -huh. or if, um, if, a root, if the decay is into the nerve, would, um, it may require a root canal. Um, if, there, if, if a patient has gum disease, which causes bone loss around the teeth, we can't ever get the bone back that has been lost, mm -hmm. but we can stop the disease process where it's at and maintain the bone level around the teeth, which ultimately helps the patient keep their teeth. Is there um, anything else you would want to add? I would just, you know, really recommend that, that patients go and see their dentist, um, you know, brush twice a day and, and floss at least once a day to, to help keep their teeth and, and gums healthy. Okay. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. My pleasure.